Hello and welcome to the channel Fabrico. Today we are going to sew flora bodies. This asymmetrical bodies features a zipper in the middle back seam and cut off sides on the front and back. The bodice is lined. As usual, you can download the PDF pattern in the description box below the video. We recommend using denim and cotton. It's better to use cotton fabric for lining. You will also need a metal separating zipper, interfacing, cotton lining and bias cut fusible tape. Let's get cutting. It's highly important to decay the fabric before cutting to prevent it from shrinking during sewing. We lay out the patterns on the fabric, observing direction of the grain line. It is indicated on the patterns and trace the patterns along the contour. Do not forget to transfer all control marks onto the cutting pieces. So cut the pieces. After cutting, double check the number of pieces according to the pattern pieces list. And do not forget to interface the pieces as indicated on the patterns. Let's get sewing and we start with the main bodies. Press the left seam allowance of the front center to the wrong side. Sew the right side of the front to the front center piece, folding the parts right sides together. Press seam allowances onto the center piece. Sew the left side of the front to the front center piece. Folding the parts right sides together, press the seam allowances. Sew the back sides to the front sides, press seam allowances. Sew the back center pieces to the back sides, press seam allowances. The zipper. Sew first one side of the zipper, placing it to the back piece right sides together, and then sew the second side of the zipper. Press the zipper placket in half, fold it inside out and stitch along the sides. Cut out the corners, flip them inside out and press them. Sew the placket under the left side of the zipper. Facings Sew the right top front facing to the top back facing along the side seam. Press the allowances. Sew the left front top facing and the back top facing along the side seam. Press the allowances. Sew the right front bottom facing and the back bottom facing. Sew the left front bottom facing and the back bottom facing. Stitch the top right and left edges of the bodies with facings. Top stitch along the facings at 1 mm from the stitching seam. Stitch the corner of the central back piece with a facing. Cut out corners, flip right side out, press. Stitch the corner of the central front piece, including the edge of the left front piece. Cut out corners, turn inside out and press. Stitch the bottom right and left edges of the bodies with facings. Top stitch along the facings at 1 mm from the stitching seam. Stitch the corner of the central back piece with a facing. Cut out corners, flip right side out and press. Stitch the corner of the central front piece, including the edge of the left front piece. Cut out corners, flip right side out, press. And finally, the lining. Sew the right and left sides of the front of the lining to the central part of the front of the lining. Press the allowances onto the central piece. 
sew the back sides to the front sides, leaving an unstitched opening in the left side seam. Press allowances to the front. Sew the central back pieces to the back sides, press the allowances onto the central piece. Sew the lining to the zipper, placing the pieces right sides together. Sew the lining to the top and bottom facings. Flip the bodies through the opening in the left side seam of the lining. Press. Stitch the left side seam of the lining as far as possible. Sew the remaining section along the edge. Top stitch along the top edge, the fold of the centerpiece and the bottom edge of the right side of the bodies. Top stitch along the top and bottom edges of the left side of the bodies, bending the central part. Make a securing stitch right above the stitching seam of the left side with the central part of the front. And give the bodies a final press.